Hi, I'm Chef Z, and cleaning your Ninja Duel Brew coffee system is just as easy as it is to brew your favorite drinks in it. It's important to regularly clean your coffee maker as calcium scale buildup could affect the flavor of your coffee over time. Luckily, the Ninja Dual Brew coffee system takes the guesswork out of determining when to clean your coffee maker. The clean button on the front display of the coffee maker will illuminate orange when a clean cycle is needed. To clean the inside of your unit, all you need is some white vinegar or a specific formula made for coffee maker descaling. Today, I'm going to show you how simple it is to clean your Ninja Dual Brew coffee system with white vinegar. First, you will need to determine which mode to clean. You will want to clean the mode that you use the most, so if you primarily brew with grounds, run a clean cycle on the grounds mode with the sliding lid closed. If you primarily use pods, ensure the Ninja Pod adapter is installed and run a clean cycle through the Ninja Pod adapter. If hot water is used at all, run an additional clean cycle in hot water mode. Once you have determined which mode you need to run the clean cycle on, pour white vinegar into the water reservoir until it reaches the travel mug line. This should be about 16 ounces of vinegar. Then fill the rest of the reservoir with fresh filtered water to the max fill line. Next, place the empty carafe on the unit and ensure you're set up in the correct mode to clean. Today, we're going to clean the grounds mode, so I'm going to slide the signing lid closed to enter grounds mode. Now press the clean button. You will notice the full carafe icon and the start brew begin to flash. Now press start brew button to begin the clean cycle. The cleaning cycle takes about 75 minutes to complete and you'll see the clock on the unit will display how much time is left in the cleaning cycle. It's common to notice pauses throughout the cleaning cycle, but it's important that you do not remove the carafe until the cycle is completely finished. You'll know the cleaning cycle is complete when the unit beeps and you see the clean light turn off. After the cleaning cycle has finished, remove the reservoir, hand wash it with soapy water, and fill it to the full line with fresh water. Next, Ninja recommends running a full carafe on classic brew with just water to flush out the system. Once this is done, simply hand wash or place your carafe, brew basket, and water reservoir in the dishwasher to prevent any residual cleaning solution from ending up in your next brew. Remember, the next time the clean light turns on, run a clean cycle on the remaining mode that wasn't previously cleaned. To clean the Ninja Pot adapter, all you have to do is remove it and hand wash it in some warm, soapy water. To maintenance the rest of your unit, twist and remove the frother whisk from the side of the unit. Remove the Ninja Smart scoop and water reservoir and place the carafe and the rest of these parts in your dishwasher or wash by hand with warm soapy water and allow to dry. Once dried, you're ready to start brewing again. If you're looking for more tips and tricks and recipe inspiration, visit ninjatestkitchen.com or join the official Ninja Foodie family community on Facebook.